Hello, my name is Still Oleg, and in this video I will show you how I prepare images in Photoshop for burning. I have this photo in JPEG format. Almost all my works are in standard A4, A3, A2 format. I defined the aspect ratio for this format as 1 to 1.31. From the menu on the left, select the rectangular marquee tool and left click to select the rectangular region in the photo. The area is not selected correctly. To fix it, click this button. It will change the aspect ratio. Now, aspect ratio selected correctly. But we have another problem. Annie's entire head needs to fit into this rectangular area. I will show you how I resolve this problem. First, let's take a look at the width of the image. Width 548 pixels. Height 878 pixels. To solve this problem, I need to increase the width by 200 pixels. To do this, I will create a new file 200 pixels wider. That is 738 pixels. The height will remain the same. Left click and hold down the mouse button and drag the window to the right. Next, left click in the main program window and press two buttons, Ctrl and A. Select the Move tool. Left click and hold down the button. Drag the photo into the new window. Place the photo in the center. Next, I select the polygonal lasso tool to cut a piece of Annie's shirt. Then I select Move tool again and drag the piece of shirt into the new window. I need some of these pieces. Next, I press Ctrl Alt Shift E keys to copy everything onto one layer. Now all these layers are superfluous and I am deleting them. I took the eyedropper tool and copied black color from the background of the image. And then I take a brush, a large, and paint over the white areas. Now I grab the rectangular Maki tool again and try to select a rectangular region with the selected aspect ratio. OK, Annie's head fits completely. It remains only to cut off the excess. Go to Image and select Crop. Let's take another look at the size. The image size is slightly larger than A4 format. I need an image to walk in A3 format. I will increase the height to 1200 pixels. The width will increase proportionally in accordance with the aspect ratio. This concludes the first part of the video. See you in the second part.